and do remembrance of Allah certain times a day with no distraction. It only takes 10 minutes, 10, 10 minutes. Or after each prayer, five minutes. You got a baby, carry them and do it. Say it with your mouth. Wallahi, it'll make a huge effect on your soul without you even realizing. Wallahi, you don't need to think about it. Just do it. Have 15 minutes in a day designated just to try and read Quran. If you don't know how to read Quran in Arabic, have you memorized anything? Read them in those 10 minutes. Read the English if you want. It's fine. It's okay. Do you think the Prophet ﷺ could read? He memorized and he read out of memory, recited. Do you think the mother of Imam Ahmad, the greatest, one of the greatest of all scholars, could read? She was illiterate and she was a widow. And look what she brought up. Your energy can be invested, insha'Allah, in these beings and in your soul. And you become a happier person, insha'Allah, in your marriage and as a mother, as a sister, as a daughter. And I think, insha'Allah, you'll be more valuable to our society and community than one who thinks materialistically or bodily without her soul.